I don't see, see anybody. Copy that. There you go. Thanks. Okay, what you need to do is pull on top of this white spot right here, and the canine's going to check your car, and then you can go on up to the gate. Up to the white just, spot? Yeah, see this big white spot in the road? Oh, right. Oh, oh, yeah, that. that big white spot. Thanks. <laughs> nice puppy. Cool. Now where do we go? Straight, I guess. They're probably radioing like all over with their little Secret Service ear things. Uh, White House morons entering now. <laughs> White House impaired filmmakers. How you doing? Hi. Hey, try D. Oh, we just took them away. Here goes mine. And Ouch. Okay, we're back. Okay. What else do they have to check? They just checked them. Okay, here you go. You know where you're going? No. No? Well, the, the appointment spots are the first five on the left. Okay. You can park anywhere there. Right. And you're going to the west wing, which is that canopy on the right-hand side. Canopy on the right-hand side. Right. Okay, got it. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. I should change. the white balance is okay. Wow. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hi. Watch the White House furniture. Let me just take that out. Okay. Huh? Yeah, actually, she knows we are. Um, so I should have told you. This is for George? Yeah. All right. It, Laura, if it's for George, we can do it in here. I mean, I, I just thought you were going to walk around video the, the building. No, no, no. This is She's for George in here. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, really? To yeah. do it in here? Yes. Is, it, is that it's, easier? Yeah. Can you office. just do it in here? Because the president's not going to be involved in it, right? Oh, no, no, no. Okay. I thought he was the only one. No. Okay. That's fine. Oh, hi. He's here. Hi. How are you? George. I'm Kristen. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Shane. He's Shane. Have a seat. Every president has faced adversity. Uh, times of war, great crisis. And there's no question about that. I mean, uh, and Franklin Roosevelt came under unrelenting criticism by an awful lot of people. I think part of the difference between then and now, though, is the the volume and the intensity of the m media coverage. You know that uh, the ideas now travel so much more quickly and with so much more ferocity than in the past. That uh, there's just this cloud of noise around any president and at least half of it's going to be bad what is the real problem in the country the real problem in the country as i said is i think that the economy even though it's strong is not producing a better standard of living for people and what are the excuse me <laughs> Just getting into the White House and knowing that we were on all the guards' lists was enough excitement for one day. We came to hear from the young guy in the administration, but we hardly had a chance to get started when the boss came in, George went out, and our interview ended. They had specifically asked us to come on a Saturday because Laura said the Clintons would be in Camp David. But apparently, there was more going on in the West Wing today than us, because the president had to call an emergency meeting. So we didn't get exactly what we had come for, but we did sit one almost open door away from the President of the United States. Tomorrow, on the other side of Washington, we'll do an interview. Okay, so Ralph Reed is out of the question for August, but there is a conference going on called Road to Victory Conference. It takes place in Washington, and it is a bunch of Republicans, basically, along with pres the presidential candidates. And, you know, we'll get you in there and you can talk to him for 10 to 15 minutes and put in, that's what he's saying. I guess the answer is